for this. A daily drill in northern Ukraine. Just a few kilometers from the Belarusian border. The 100th Brigade is a territorial defense unit. Many of them former civilians, teachers, builders, plumbers, who've taken up the fight. These live fire exercises are preparation for any possible incursion. A border of more than a thousand kilometers, with this protected stretch now heavily mined. Just across this lake is Putin's closest ally in the war on Ukraine. And this is the last outpost before you get into Belarusian territory. Belarus has provided Russia with extensive military support. They've even transported Russian troops into the country, but they've stopped short at sending in their own soldiers. And the drills have been on the other side too. Just recently, Putin and Belarus's Lukashenko put on a mass display of collective strength. Russia invaded the country from the north last February, and Ukraine's top defense officials warn of another northern intrusion. But the Ukrainians say they won't be caught off guard again. Captain Sidorchuk shows us around and says he's feeling confident about their defensive position. Ну вот такая вот башня высота. Кругом все видно, как бы мы на высоте проглядывается парахрестя, можно працювати як гранатометом, як стрілецькою зброєю і всім іншим. Not far from this fortress are the communities that straddle the border. Generations who've never lived anywhere else, now living in the shadow of a potential new front. Nadia and her daughter Svetlana would rather die than leave. Fear is building as armies on both sides prepare for possible confrontation. But little can prepare the people for what might come.